Ajay Kumar and Sapoy Bijendra have reached Jaipur at this point. We're cutting across to those visuals that have come in. We're crossing over to my colleague Gajraj to get us more on this. Uh, Gajraj, we're learning that the mortal remains of the two brave hearts have now reached Jaipur. We can see procession on our screens at this point. Tell us more about what's taking place. Yes, sir. Right now, you know, uh, see the you know uh, remains of uh, Sepoy, Ajay Kumar, and Vijay. Like uh, they have arrived uh, just now. It was you know the uh, likely to uh, the before time uh, which we have got uh, was 7:30, but now they have finally uh, you know uh, arrived uh, with the remains here. And now uh, here, uh, you know, cabinet ministers are present at this spot uh, along with you know uh, LOP Tikaram Juli and PCC chief Govind Tasra are you know also at the spot. And uh, you can also see uh, the crowd that is. Uh, present uh, to pay their respects uh, to these brave hearts and from here uh, after the ceremony they will be taken uh, to Junjunu to, the, to their native places uh, where uh, you know a uh, few more ceremonies will uh, take place. Studio. All right Gajraj thank you so much for joining us and getting us those details. Now, essentially, the mortal remains of the two brave hearts, Sapoy Ajay Kumar and Sapoy Bajendra, have reached Jaipur. That is the procession that you can see on your screens right now. This comes just a day after the wreath laying ceremony of the army personnel had taken place. They remember lost their lives in the Doda encounter, and they're going to be laid to rest today. Now the nation pays tribute and the country honors the supreme sacrifice of our security forces. Now shifting focus. Reports